Hey YouTube, Ray from Badger Tuners here to do a unboxing video of the Holly 550-513 Holly EFI. This is a bad dude, supports up to 1200 horsepower and 800 CFM and if you know anything about Holly EFI you know that you can set up everything so that you have full control of your ignition system, your uh, spark curve, everything that you need to do uh, to use a standalone system is pretty cool. So let's get to it. Here's the box. I don't know if you can see it. 550-513. And there she is. One bad dude. Alright. Your wide band. And you probably only get about four to five feet of it. Not a whole lot there. All right. Throttle controls. Looks like pretty much your standard 4150 carburetor that you can connect it to. It fits to your standard uh, spread bore flange. So here's your other connectors. Let's see if I can zoom in for you. you. Get two more. One more big one. And another medium one. So this is an eight pin, ten pin, and a five, six, seven, seven pin. Alright, then you got, looks like your uh, choke, and then here's your um, vacuum. You get two, one, two vacuum, and then a three-eighths vacuum. Let's see if I can measure this for you. Yep, three-eighths size vacuum, and then these are both quarter, quarter inch size. Okay, so there she is in all her glory. Super Sniper, sexy bitch. Alright, let's talk about some of this other stuff we get here. Looks like you get in this bag 271R1139 Alpha. You get 7 feet of split loom. And then here's your 10 uh, pin harness that's going to connect to. All right, and this measures out to five feet. You're not going to get a whole lot on here, okay? All right, your next bag, Holly 271R1140A is an apple. All right, same thing, seven feet of split loom. And you're pretty much your standard harness, which this one's a little bit more, you get six feet. Okay, and that goes to your eight pound. You can see that there. All right, and your main harness. All right, you get your fuel pump. This is the positive. Everything comes with a pretty cool little tab on there. Makes it easy to find what is what. You got a relay, and then your power line comes with a 30 amp fuse. And then you got your power line, you get seven feet of power line. And then this goes to your seven pin. All right, and then you get probably about two, three feet of everything else, and there's one little connect. All right, and then one bag of cool instructions, and you get your uh, little warranty card. Make sure you send it in, instructions to go online. You get a free extended warranty. All you got to do is register so they know who you are, so they can send you emails and send you cool stuff. Uh, you get a spreadboard card gasket, and 
air cleaner gasket. And you get another box. All right, you get more uh, split loom. And I just want to talk about the split loom real quick. It's pretty darn cool stuff. See how it's wrapped? See that? I don't know if you can see it or not, but it wraps so you can actually coil it around all your wire. It's pretty cool stuff. It's uh, nylon. It's that nylon braid. And so let's see how much you get of this one. Just a little short of six feet. And then you get the other connector for your coolant wire. Possible. I don't know for sure if that's your coolant wire. Could be talking on my ass. And then you get woohoo, the bad dude. All right, and then so you get a little card. Looks like a pretty much standard micro SD card. Made by Kingston. There's the numbers on the display. And there's your sniper display. And it measures out to about three and a quarter wide and two and three quarter tall. Not the biggest display, but it'll get you where you need to go. They also have bigger monitors you can get. They're pretty cool. And it runs to uh, a four pin. Looks like you get 92 inches, almost a little short of eight feet. So you might have to uh, economize, make sure you go through the through your firewall or something to get it there. In the little baggie you get a stylus, a couple of stick-ons, and some antiseptic wipes to clean up for your stickers. And then you get some band clamps. And they go from 2.36 to 2.5. 7.2. So it looks like it's made just to fit probably a two and a half inch exhaust, which is pretty standard on a lot of Chevys. You get a little gasket and a bracket. You put your clamp on there. So you drill a hole in your exhaust and boom, boom, zoom, zoom. You got your wide band hooked up. And then, of course, you get your wide band. It's got a connector that's pretty standard, most AEM. Wide bands use this. Same, and then it's the Holly sensor is a 226R68. This is Holly in there, I don't know if you can see it. You get a coolant temp sense. It looks like it is a two pin. Here, I'll open the bag so you can see it. Looks like pretty much a 3 8 MPT plug. I don't know if you can see that or not. And your USB cable. And it goes to your four pin connector there. I'll show you this bad boy one more time. Looks like it's got a pretty nice finish, powder coat fuel bowls each side. Here's the number. Made in Canada. Our bros to the north talk a little funny, but we still like them anyway. They make all our cars. Can't blame them. All right, that's it. So buy from me, Badger Tuners. You can go to www.badgertuners.com. I'm the little guy. I'm not the big box store. I brought this video so you can see it. Hopefully, uh, you'll buy from us. Thank you very much, YouTube. Thanks for watching this video.